know you. Give me that. This, uh, mm, three. I need it for a thing. Two. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Uh. Man, you are spry for an old guy. Just drop the device and you can go. No, I told you I need it. This isn't personal. Just stop. Speak for yourself. You stop. Not gonna happen. Why do you want this thing so bad? It's just a job. You're starting to get on my nerves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I get that a lot. Nice try, pal, but you're out of runway. Open the door. Uh, no thanks. You're from that dead set group in San Francisco, aren't you? You mean the one that busted you out of a cage guarded by 20 Eastern European gangsters? <laughs> <laughs> I seem to remember that was mostly your friend. But now you're alone. This isn't a dead sec op, is it? Yeah, well, I grew out of dead sec ops a long time ago. Come on! Oh, shit! Stop! Please! Wow! Stop! their cameras it gets worse you just tripped a script payload that locked you in there what the hell hello thomas looking for this is he gonna do it is he gonna is he gonna do it i didn't go through all this just to set you back I wanna fuck you the way you fucked me with a sandpaper condom on my fist. Hey, Aiden. Uh, in the spirit of uh, friendly whatever we are, just thought I'd let you know that that's not my real safe house you're outside of right now. It's, uh, nope, it's, it's a decoy. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, it's a decoy. It's over, Wrench. Tell me where you are. Ah, uh, no can do. Oh, and if any security drones show up, just know they'll leave you alone as soon as you go away. So, please go away. Not going to happen. All right, so, yeah, that, that is my real safe house. You got me. <laughs> but of course, I had an emergency exit. I mean, could you imagine if I didn't have another way out of here? <laughs> How dumb would I have to be? I mean, pretty dumb. <laughs> Can I call first? Hey, 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 come on, come on. We're on the same side here. Broker Bridge. Now. There. Really? Thomas? What? I've already said everything I need to say to you, so this is actually a message for Aiden. Still there, buddy? What the hell is this? Hold on. Don't worry, it's a quick one. <laughs> Go! Stop the... Go! Yes, sir, Mr. Pierce, your honored motor carriage has a wrap. Oh, shit! <sighs> what the fuck happened? If he was just unconscious, he would still react to pain and sound. But he's not. What do you mean? He's like in a coma or something? Shit, how do you fix a coma? They're taking him to a hospital. Where we'd be a rampart bait? Not an option. So I'm gonna need some bandages, iodine, and IV. Whoa, 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 slow your roll there, Florence Nightingale. I'm gonna go get geared up, and then you can give me your shopping list. And where are you planning on getting that stuff? I don't know, maybe I'll hijack an ambulance or something. Look, you stay here, you look after Aiden, okay? And don't worry, Uncle Rich has got this under control. Hello? Aiden, what? Wait, who the fuck are you? 
Where's Aiden? Uh, wrong number! So, what's the verdict? Did that doctor's info help? There's nothing on how to actually revive someone from a coma. So I'm just stuck waiting for when, or if he wakes up. Don't worry, he's Aiden fucking Pierce. He'll wake up again. That's easy for you to say. But what if he doesn't? What the hell do we do then? Look, you can stay here for as long as you need. I'm gonna go blow up the other half of Rembart's face. Are you kidding? Aiden's in a coma right now, and you're thinking about revenge. Uh, yeah. Or do you not remember the crazy robot man who wants us all dead? Do you not remember that you're the reason why Rampart went after Aiden in the first place? And why Aiden is in a coma right now? Wow. Hurtful. I didn't have time to give you a mounted Gatling laser gun. The next time, little buddy. Promise. Fine. Ah, shit. It's Aiden's phone again. All right, asshole. I've tracked your location. This is your final warning. Blah, blah, blah. Bottom line. Let Aiden Pierce go, or I'm gonna send a bunch of people your way to cut you into tiny little pieces and deliver them to me gift-wrapped. Capiche? Jesus, dude! Listen, I'm, I'm not holding Aiden hostage. I'm helping! Jackson, back me up! What the fuck? You're with Jackson. I thought you were one of Rempart's hired mooks. Hold on, hold on. You got a private channel or something? I gotta get off this burner. One sec. All right, I'm back. And I've got some burning questions. So one, who the fuck are you? And two, what happened to Aiden? Well, I'm Wrench, and Aiden is in a coma. A fucking coma? How the hell did that happen? I kind of, uh, half blew him up. <laughs> Shit. Now I've got a problem here, Ratchet. It's Wrench. I have a fixer contract that needs doing, but my best guy is out. Indefinitely. I thought Rempart was responsible, but now I'm finding out it's you. Uh, partially responsible? Please don't chop me into little pieces. Okay, Ratchet. I need you to wipe some data from Rempart facilities. Can you handle that? Got it. Go to Nexus Tower and steal their prototype combat drone. Not what I said, but, uh, sure. Let's see where this goes. Greetings. Reginald Blackman. Ah, Jesus! Sky Larson is in the sitting room. Your fucking house knows my name? Whoa! Cool hologram! <gasps> is this about the Death Star plans? I need you to pay attention, Mr. Blackman. It's Wrench. I know you have the broker bridge. Uh, moi? <laughs> okay, no, you're right. I am holding on to it. But just for safekeeping, Scout's honor. Hmm. I need you to clear out his forces and give me control of my lab's back. Okay, I'm not even gonna get into how creepy it is that you know all this shit, but you said you could help Aiden? Wrench smash! But just like your ex, I moved on to better. And just like his car, I'm gonna fuck up your shit with a sledgehammer. Come on, big guy. How long does this usually take? I'm eager to find out. What, wait, wait, what? You, you mean you've never done this before? This is the first human trial. The most exciting phase of the project. God damn it, you fucking lied to us! You never cared about taking Rampart out of your labs. You just want us here to be your fucking guinea pigs. Semantics. Jackson, this is insane. Hey, there is no guarantee this is gonna wake up Aiden. I, I, I say we, we grab him, we, we get the fuck out of here, and we'll find a better way. There isn't a better way. I have to do it. You could wind up in a coma too, or worse. Everyone deserves a chance. Oh my God, that sounds so incredibly profound. What the fuck does that even mean? Try. Shit. Why, hello there, you hot piece of drone. <laughs> you, uh, want to get out of here? I know a nice little spot where we can park and, uh, you know, talk and stuff. Don't tell your dad. 
<laughs> Weird, man. Uh, but who am I to judge? Let's do this. It's escaping! Come back, ghost car! Don't go into the light! Stop doing the fucking ghost car bed and start chasing the car. Christ! Eyes on the road, wrench. It's getting away. Damn it. Lost my connection. It ghosted us! Damn it! <laughs> you get it? Because it's, it's a ghost. Oh my god, shut up. I got a cleaner bead on the signal now. I think I know where it's hiding. Don't you mean where it's haunting? <laughs> Go get the fucking car! Fuck you, you fascist! You think this is easy to do with the mask? That raucous energy is exactly what we need right now. Ready to work. I guess I'll take my business elsewhere. I said good day, sir. Ah. Love the whole quaint little pub thing you've got going on here. Creepy mask, spikes everywhere. Yeah, Jackson told me you'd be coming. Hi. So, word is you know a good place to get medical supplies on the down low. Clan Kelly's got loads of stuff that are moving through the underworld. How do you feel about robbing from the robbers? Sounds like a sexy good time. Where can I find these black market stashes? I'll send a couple of locations to your optic. You're doing this to help Aiden, yeah? Make sure that stubborn fool stays breathing. Hey, listen. I propose giving him mouth to mouth, but, you know, with the mask and the spikes, it's kind of chafy, so... Get moving! Holy shit! You did it! Ha! Very impressive. Some of the readings on the broker bridge were wholly unexpected. I don't know whether to punch you or kiss you on your stupid hologram mouth. Both? As our business is concluded here today, gentlemen, I suggest you wrap things up and take your leave. Both. Definitely both. Ah, oh, what a beautiful reunion. Gosh, I'm tearing up over here. You can't tell, though, because of the mask. I feel like that angel from that movie. Now that I've brought Mr. Pierce and Mr. Pierce back together, I can go get my wings. Thanks for all your help, Wrench. No need to thank me. Just promise me your firstborn. And now, I'm off. Meet the Mark II. Piloted by a human. No broker bridge. Oh, fuck me. Care for a demonstration? Jackson! Aiden! How do I fight this thing? Adieu, motherfucker! Holy... No use. I can build another prototype. You have no way of stopping me. Oh, I've got one way. with you for the money. I mean, sure, I thought you were a spoiled asshole with too much hair wax, by the way. Founder of Brokertech. I have a proposal for you. We should speak in person. No, you send an offer to my people and maybe I'll consider. 
I'm the only chance you have of saving Aiden Pierce. I'll send the coordinates to your optic. Hey, Jackson. What do you know about Sky Larson? I literally have her books on my shelf. I have a subscription to her Masterclass webinar series, and I won her Larson Family Scholarship. She's brilliant. Okay, didn't expect to unpack a big crush there. Super sweet. But I think there's something sketchy about this. Okay, one, don't be mad that the love of your life was flirting with me. And two, you get the feeling we're jumping into a shitstorm here? Your buddy in San Francisco wants you to call him back. Whoa, what? Hey, did you read my diary? No. Dude, you play those voicemails from Marcus all the time. On speaker. Just call him back. Trust me. Oh, okay. Uh, shut up. I won't lie. I didn't expect you to turn him over to Albie in custody. Well, I asked myself, what would Aiden Pierce do? And then I asked myself, is that who I really wanted to be? And look, no offense, big guy. I think you made the right call. Even if I wanted to smash him into teeny tiny little pieces and scatter them all over the Thames and turn him into seagull shit. Well... Progress is a journey. What's next on the docket for you? Heading home? Nah, I think I might hang around London for a bit, wrap up a few things. But I do think I'll give Marcus a call, though. Actually, hey, yeah, I wanna, I wanna take a selfie in front of Big Ben and send it to him. Or maybe I should go to Buckingham Palace and steal a roll of some royal TP. <laughs> get him a souvenir. Great. Looks like whatever trouble you get into, we'll have to fish you out of it. Aw, that's so sweet. What a nice family moment. We really do make the dream team, don't we? Jackson and his two uncles. Two uncles? Shh, shh. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Thanks for the information. But if you really want to help us, how long? Quick, Albion is about to blow up London Bridge. Sure they are. Well, not yet. I've marked a potential recruit for you, and by recruit I mean a masked madman who hacked our optic channel and started telling everyone he was in charge. Well, I mean, I do have seniority. Who would have focused this? You see what I'm dealing with here? His credentials check out. Just give him something to do to get him off my ass, would you? What's going on here? Is that any way to greet your new boss? <laughs> I'm fucking with you, come on. Everyone knows Desek doesn't have bosses. Think of me more as a cool older brother. That you occasionally have naughty thoughts about me. I don't like this. Hey, hey. I'm just a boy. Standing in front of a resistance group. Asking them to let me beat up some dudes with a sledgehammer for them. Is that so wrong? Is it? Fuck it. All right. Fuck yeah. See you out there. Uh, you. Whatever your name is. <laughs>